So what is going on with the Ilco key blank directory? Now, if you work with locks and keys, which if you're watching this video, I'm guessing you probably do. And you know, it's really been about a year since the catalog went out of print, the directory went out of print. And on top of that, that directory was, you know, over 10 years old when it was last printed, right? So it was kind of out of date. And so many of you have been like, hey, where's that new one out? I thought it was gonna be out in around August, what's going on? So to really get to the bottom of this question and get you the best answer that I can, I went ahead and got Walter with Ilko on. I hope you enjoy. Well, hey, Walter, um, thank you so much for joining me and uh, allowing me to kind of pick your brain really about the uh, new Key Blank catalog. Yeah, sure. Absolutely, PJ. I'm glad to be here. Good to be with you. So, you know, uh, before we get going, so the last time that um, I had talked to someone at Ilco about this, it was Brandy, and I know that she's now in a different position. So before we start getting um, or having too much fun um, with the catalog topic or the directory topic, could you kind of introduce yourself a little bit, kind of how long have you been at Ilco um, and what you do there? Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, so I'm Walt Fulner, and I'm our senior marketing manager for North America Key Systems. And uh, I've been with Ilco since February of this year, and I'm new to industry, but primarily my role is to get an understanding of the market that we service uh, and communicate with the market of how we can best benefit them in their day-to-day -day lives. I, uh, I work with some subject matter experts, uh, the product managers and all of our product lines. So the key blank product manager, the storefront hardware cylinder, uh, key cutting machines, digital solutions, and automotive solutions. Um, but, you know, typically marketing is people think of uh, promos or advertisements or social media, and, and, and I'm involved in all of that as well. So basically, my goal is to communicate effectively with the market and how we can help improve uh, your day to day operations. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, that's a, that's a lot. I mean, there's a lot of different, I mean, just talking about cylinders or, uh, metal keys or uh, automotive keys. I mean, that just those three alone is a wide spectrum. And so I'm kind of curious, like, so before you came to Ilco, uh, how much knowledge and understanding of key blanks in general did you have? Very little, very little. I mean, I have keys to open up my doors in my house and my car. And um, I had no idea that the amount of technical information and engineering and details are so instrumental in everything that we manufacture. I mean, I, I had no idea that there were many key blanks uh, as there as there are. And one thing that I found to be interesting was the amount of key blanks that are manufactured here at Ilco each year. I had no idea that the market uh, need, had a demand for that quantity. I, <laughs> I, I assume yeah. there's some great void out there that everyone's dumping their keys in uh, so we can manufacture more. But no, 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 it was, it's, it's been a, an education for sure. And with all the acronyms and uh, uh, the details of each product line, I mean, months, I was confused. It wasn't even, I didn't understand the language. And so the nomenclature is becoming more familiar to me. I have a better understanding of it now. Uh, but I mean, it, it takes, it takes some time to, to understand what's going on. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, as someone, you know, as people get into the industry and they start trying to learn key blanks or automotive and all that, I mean, it's, it's overwhelming. And to be on the manufacturing end of that, uh, I mean, I can only imagine can get complicated at times. So yeah, that's interesting. So yeah. now forever, um, you are ruined when it comes to keys, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 I, I am. So, you know, it was about, uh, I don't know, 10, 11 months ago, you know, I, we had um, brought Br uh, Brandy on and we were kind of talking about updating the key blank directory and a question that we were getting a lot then and we're actually still getting a lot now is, hey, PJ, so where is the new key blank directory? I can't get the old one. I want the printed version. Um, when am I going to be able to get that? And so is what I want to do is kind of box that question up, put a little gift wrap on it for you and just kind of hand it to you and be like, so Walter, 
Um, when can we get a printed version of the Ilco Keyblink directory? Yeah, it will be the uh, early part of 2023. We're hopeful that'll be the first or second month, January, February of 2023. You'll be able to have the printed hard copy of the Keyblank directory. Um, and as I know you're well aware, and I think a lot in our market are aware, there are digital copies readily available on our website and then also on our our application, uh, our phone and web browser app, mykeyspro.com. Um, it has all of our offerings in one envelope from all the key blanks to lookalike remotes, transponder keys, key cutting machines, and uh, and soon all of our cylinder offerings as well. So uh, digitally, it's available now. Go to ilco.us um, to, to see uh, uh, the new key blank directory, but the hard copy will be early 2023. Okay, so yeah, so just to really clarify, so the the actual new, the 13th edition after, what, about a 12-year time frame has been from the 12th to the 13th is actually done. The digital copy is available. Um, for everyone watching, I'll put a link in the notes below that will take you to the page that will list out all of the different um, groups, different key groups. And so you can actually look at that actually right now, which is really cool. Um, but the printed version isn't going to be till the beginning ish of next year to the best of your knowledge, I guess, at this point. That's right. Yep. So, you know, kind of what I'm curious about, though, from from Ilko's perspective, from your perspective, like what is new and or different about the 13th edition? Like what, what can people when they go click on the links and they check it out, like what are they going to notice that is different? The, some of the major changes, any new offering, any new product offerings uh, since the 2010 release will be included in the key blank directory. So all of our new key blanks, um, any new key cutting machines, all new imagery for those products. Um, uh, and then also all of our lookalike uh, key remotes will be included in uh, the, uh, the key blank directory as well. Yeah, so I mean that's huge to have all of those keys now in that guide. Now, is it gonna? Is it? Are those? Are all the pictures? Are they color or the technical drawings? What do those actually look like? No, no, they're 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 actual pictures. Um, of course, not pictures of every key blank, but um, they're they're graphics of each of each uh, key uh, to scale or to size, to actual size, and so um, and the look likes the same. So, okay. Cool. Well, you know, so something that I find kind of fascinating, right, is like we live in this like digital age now, right, where like we communicate, there's so much information available, we communicate so quickly when it comes to um, using anything online, right? But when it comes to key blanks and you're having like, you have this key blank here, you need to try to find it. So you're, you want that book that's sitting right behind you there, right? You want to look through and you want to compare and there's still something to be said. Here we are, 2022, um, the new printed version in 23. And we still want that, that key that we can look at, compare all the little nuances of the size, the shape, how long is the um, shaft on it, how long did the, does the milling go up, all of those little things still. And so, you know, I'm kind of curious from your perspective, Ilko's perspective. I mean, it's one of those things that I'm sure it would be nice to not have to go to uh, such great lengths to get this printed copy in hands in a digital world, but it's still so needed. I mean, is that a conversation that, that um, you guys have over there? Yeah. I mean, it, and, and we were decisive with what we wanted to do because I mean, it's a big undertaking to spend this amount of time and, uh, and create a hard copy of the key blank directory. And it's, it's expensive too, to put it together and have it printed um, for our, for our market. But um, in addition to the, the hard copy, as I mentioned, the, the digital side, you know, there are copies readily available on our website. And then also within My Keys Pro, you'll find all of our key blank offerings. Um, but we, we do have some things in the works that I, I'm not ready to share with you yet, but I believe that will be a, a nice alternative to, you know, the, the traditional, you'll take the key and you'll put it up against the book to see if that's the right size. And um, so what, what we could do is we could, uh, we can make a later date and come back and talk about that uh, initiative a little bit. Uh, down the road when we're ready to present it. But um, yeah, we're excited about that. Interesting. You know, like when you talk about that, like there's some things that come to my head and um, I know you'd tell us more if you could, so I'm not going to, I won't poke, but uh, I'm, I'm excited <laughs> I, to hear what, what that is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm, we're excited to tell you. It's just not, we're not quite there yet, but you'll know okay. when we're ready. 
Okay. Now, when it comes to, you know, something that has kind of crossed my mind, like adding all of the key blank or all of the remote head keys, you know, all, all those lookalikes and adding all the stuff to the catalog. I'm imagining that this new catalog is going to be pretty thick. Like, are we thinking double the size of the, the one sitting behind you or like how much, how, how big is this thing going to be? It's going to be bigger. Um, it's not double, but it's, uh, you know, the page count is it's well into the fours. I don't think it's quite 500 pages, but it'll be hefty. I mean, you're going to have to stretch before you pick it up and make sure you don't twist too much when you're lifting it so you don't strain yourself. So it's got a lot of content in it and we worked hard on it and we really hope everything that we put into it uh, is beneficial to anyone in need of that information. Okay. Yeah. So, you know, I have a couple of questions here and uh, I'll, I'll let you go, but uh, I'm, I'm curious as we're talking here, like I'm guessing that Ilco is continually putting out new keys. Right. And with this catalog already kind of technically done, getting ready to be printed, what happens with the new keys that are being uh, uh, made? Like, how are you going to be releasing those? Um, will they be included in the digital version? Just my keys pro. Like how could, how could someone now, I know for us, like we get announcements. And so, um, you know, and we do our best to communicate that, but if someone was wanting to get that information directly from Ilco, what's the best way for them to kind of stay updated on the new keys? Hey, as you stated, the key news that we send out is our, uh, is our major announcement that we let everyone know whenever we have new keys to announce. Um, my keys pro, one of our, product launch strategies is as we add new keys to our catalog we want to make sure that the public is aware we want to make sure that it's updated in the digital version of my keys pro um but right now we're not actually sending out alerts every time we add keys to my keys pro which is probably something we should look into so everyone is, is aware but you know as you also said once the publication is finalized and it goes to print it's outdated i mean it'll be outdated for us within you know, a couple of weeks because we're continually adding new uh, new products and new keys to, to our offerings. But we do our best uh, as we are figuring out this digital world, how we can communicate new offerings uh, to the market. And so that Mikey's Pro is a, is absolutely a way to, to, to learn about our new releases. Okay, very good. So, I mean, I guess the good news is, if I, if I were to summarize our conversation, the good news is that the new directory is done and it is available on your website. Once again, I'll put a link in the notes. Everyone can go check it out and um, download the sections, take a look at them. I have done that. I went through um, quite a few of them, kind of checked it out. Cause I mean, now Walter, I have to admit, like I, I'm kind of a little bit of a key weirdo. Okay. And that is like, when I get that printed version, I will bring it home and I like to have a highlighter and I go through every single key I don't recognize and I highlight it. And I like to go back and I like to memorize the part numbers and the keyway patterns. I don't know. I mean, I, you know, you, you would think I'd want to spend that time golfing or something more exciting, but uh, <laughs> no, but I like, I like doing that, but I, I just love new keys. You know I mean? It's like one of those things that's like, man, this hitch key be so nice to have this hitch key. And then all of a sudden you find it in the directory and it's like, oh my gosh, like I, I need to familiarize myself with that. So um, I'm, I'm personally looking forward to getting the new directory and I know um, so many who are watching uh, will also. Good. Glad. I'm, I'm happy to hear that. So now as we're closing here, you know, I want to throw out an idea to you. Okay. And, uh, you know, I know uh, you like to golf. I like to golf. And I'm wondering if we can get you doing uh, John Daly, but with the Ilco Key Blank directory hitting a golf ball off the top of it. Okay, hitting off the top of it. Okay, I thought you may say try to hit it through it. Now, I don't know if that would work because it is thick. <laughs> but yeah, I'd love to do that. Maybe we can. Uh, maybe we can both hit one off the uh, the top of the new key blank directory. Yes, you know. I mean, hey, I'll, how about you do the? You'll do like the real one. I'll do like the blooper one, right? Because I'll probably <laughs> miss. But <laughs> yeah, it sounds great. Yeah, cool. Good stuff. And then how about I'll bring it when it's all said and done, when I have one in my hands, when you have one in yours, let's, uh, let's, 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 let's get together again and do one final, like, Hey, you know what? Here we are. It's done. And, um, you know, it's going to be great for the industry. So I, I personally appreciate you guys, uh, updating it and, um, adding so much to it because at the end of the day, it does 
uh, add a ton of value to anyone who works with locks and keys. So thank Good, you. Uh, You're Ron. Welcome. Thanks for working on that. So, yeah, absolutely. PJ. Yeah. Good stuff, Walter. Well, hey, um, I guess we'll uh, talk soon. And everybody, thank you for watching. And make sure you put your uh, questions um, in the uh, comments below. Thanks, PJ. So what's going on with... So what's been going on... You know, this is a question that we started... Jeez, come on, come on. Let me pull it together, man. Pull it together. Let's see. And so it's your lucky day because I. And so to get to the bottom and to answer this question, I, 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 I. Congrats, you've made it to the end. Now, I wanna make sure that when you are commenting on our videos that you include the hashtag LockBoss. When you do, you automatically get entered into win one of five free prizes we give away every Tuesday live here on YouTube. So I look forward to reading your comment and responding soon. Until next time.